Hey guys, I hope you are having a wonderful day or if you're watching this at night, have a wonderful night. So um, today I am doing a little bit of like meal prepping and I prepared my grocery list for the week. We go grocery shopping every week and I plan out all of the meals for the week. So I'm not just going grocery shopping because I'm worried about this Mm, I don't want to say it, but virus. Um, although everyone is taking everything, <laughs> so I might as well get my groceries before it's all gone. But anyways, so I have my notepad here, and I have a pen, and I have a highlighter. So I bring this with me, and I'm going to go to Aldi's, and um, I was just told not to get meat from Aldi's. I'm not sure if that's true, if their meat's bad, if it's good, I don't know. But um, I'm going to go to a different grocery store for um, the meat in general. So as you guys can tell, I have a whole list here. And then I have another whole list. And you can see that I have highlighted one of these already before I even left the house and that's because I write down everything that I need and if I still have stuff in the cupboard I go and I check the expiration date and see how much I have left so I have pizza sauce in the cover and I just um, highlighted it because I don't need it because I got it at home and then um, this one right here is just like the meat that I need for the week so we got that and then on the next one, I have everything that I am making for the week. So this week, um, so I have it Monday through Sunday on here, but some days I don't feel good and I won't make a meal then and I'll have something else or I don't have enough time and I'll make something easy that's on the list, vice versa. So, um, I'm going to be making this week crock pot baked ziti, creamy lemon chicken. I'm gonna make a roast. We make those every week. Garlic bread pizzas, um, lemon butter baked tilapia because Brad can't eat meat on Fridays, and steak bites. And I left Sunday open because um, sometimes I don't cook on Sundays and or we'll have leftovers. So that's how I go about making my grocery list. And um, I get my meal ideas, well, so I have them in my head, but I also scroll through Pinterest. So I'm always on um, Pinterest pinning things to my cooking um, board. So if you wanna follow me on Pinterest, it is, I think it's Brooke Marie Shoki, and I'll have it linked below in the description. But I have all my cooking um, board on there and it's pinned right to the top. So you guys can go and check it out. But that's where I get everything from. So let's go grocery shopping. One thing that I wanted to show you guys before I go inside the grocery store is that I found this, oh, I'll kind of bend it, but this like basket type at Dollar Tree. So I'll bring this right in the store with me because all these, they don't have, um, they have bags for you to purchase and stuff but they don't um, bag up your groceries and stuff, you do it yourself. So I have my um, reusable bags in here and I'll keep these in my vehicle or um, when I go in to go grocery shopping, I just grab this and it's all in one spot for me and stays in the cart instead of all over the place. So that's just a quick tip and these are great for organizing so many things. I'm actually gonna pick up more today as well. If I can find them at that Dollar Tree where I'm going. This place is a zoo and I haven't even gotten inside yet. So that's gonna be crazy because everyone's trying to stock up and I just want normal groceries for the week. So I'm really hoping that everything's not all gone on me. Sir, it's not time to eat yet. Hey, it's that time to eat. No, you guys, it's not time to eat. Okay, this is where I feed them every day, like right here in this spot. 
and they are going crazy okay anyways so you guys can see this is what I had my reusable um, bags in and I literally just use this um, for some glass things down here and all these and some canned goods it actually worked out really nice but this is the haul and we're going to be taking everything out and I'll show you exactly everything we got and got the art. and besides all of this this is from pick and save so I had to go there besides all that I still got some stuff up here but well I went to Dollar Tree too but I got this bird feeding station I can't remember exactly how much but it was a lot cheaper than like the farm and I got this birdhouse feeder I think that was like $8.99 and then this was like $14.99 not exactly positive, but I'm super excited to put it together. Hi, baby. Baby. Hi, buddy. The grocery stores were beyond crazy. It was so, 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 so bad. Hi, kitty. Oh, yes. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys everything that I got. It looks like a lot and like I went on a shopping spree, but really it's all um, planned out meals. So we got cream of chicken and cause I made a really great meal with that. With, um, I'm gonna see. Oh, chicken, mushrooms, and cream of chicken. We got a bunch of cream of mushrooms so I can make um, tater tot casserole and um, my dad's recipe for hot dish. Okay, and then the vegetables are for hot dish. The tomato sauce is for, um, what do I wanna call it? A meal that I guess I should have on my list. Okay, it says baked ziti, that's what that's for. I need some more season salt and I got cheese. Um, dip, we got the beef broth. I need that for my roast all the time. I have a recipe that needs the um, chicken broth. Um, all these did not have much fruit at all. And I wanna make like little sugar cookie fruit pizzas. So I got raspberries and blueberries. I like these tilts from all these. Um, I don't like coconut, but this one's good. It has the almond and chocolate chip mix. And then the key lime crunch has the graham crackers white chocolate crunch. So all these didn't have Parmesan cheese, so I went to pick and save. I got Parmesan cheese for the baked ziti. I love pepper jack cheese. I actually like the string cheese, but um, all these doesn't carry it, so I just get this now. I got a eight cups of mozzarella. We can use that for um, so right here are big old pizza bites and um, I kind of want to try to make them homemade. Brad really likes these so I decided I got some mini bagels plain. So um, I'm going to use the mozzarella for that along with the big ziti. And Brad also gets this um, Danish for work. He eats it for lunch. Not my cup of tea but that's his. <laughs> I had to get some butter. I got stuff because now that I got some meat, I, we can always have tacos. I always have taco seasoning on hand. And these liners, oh my goodness. They are a lifesaver. They're so good. So I always make sure I have them. I don't know if I said that, but we got some brownies because instead of buying something, I just got some. We got peony pasta. And these are our favorite so um, they are oh snap pickles, they're dilly bites. They have carrots, they have green beans, 
They have um, hot and spicy ones too. These come in like a six pack. I got hummus because that's so good. I got stuff here to dip it in. Of course carrots. And then we got some mint chocolate chip ice cream for Brad. Mushrooms. Brad likes wings and um, he's not necessarily an Aldi's guy, but I'm kind of converting him. But uh, I got the sweet Asian wings, so we'll see and test those out. I got bacon for helping a wrap. Poppers. Of course, I got more chicken. Pepperoni for on those bagels and for baked CD or just I want to make some pepperoni chips. So, um, of course, chocolate chip cookie mix and now I had to get the Aju gravy mix because um, this is what I use in my roast and it doesn't um, they don't carry them at all these so instead I picked up when I was at they were like 50 cents each two for a dollar I got some at pick and save and now I needed this for the baked ZD that I'm making actually in the crock pot so I needed pizza sauce Actually, not even pizza sauce. Pizza sauce I already had at home. Um, this is spaghetti sauce. And I needed some more lemon juice. And on top of that, I also got lemons. You see the jalapenos are back there. I got tater tots for tater tot casserole. The ricotta cheese is for the baked ziti. And look at this. This is what I found when I was in, um, actually on a cruise. I found Ben and Jerry's chocolate chip cookie dough um, ice cream. So good. But ice cream makes me sick. And now I found these snackable dough and it is not cheap. Let me tell you. But I'm going to try that out. It's not really low carb or anything. Actually, let me check this out. Ugh. 19 grams. There's eight servings in here. Yeah. I'll have to eat that in moderation. Um, I got sugar cookies. And I got this because I didn't feel like making sugar cookies. Don't so make that um, sugar cookie um, cookies. And now I forgot the powdered sugar because since being low carb, I don't have flour here. I don't have um, actually anything here really. Um, so we needed some fresh basil. I got three pounds of ground beef and I'll split that into three. I got the garlic bread, which all these was completely out of garlic bread. I'm gonna make, um, what are they called? Uh, garlic bread with pizza sauce, uh, mozzarella cheese and pepperoni. So that's what that's for. And since all these was out of pizza, not pizza, spaghetti sauce, I just grabbed some. I got some drumsticks, Brad don't like nuts. So they're for me in moderation. I got um, for steak bites and I also got steak for like filet steaks for just the air fryer. I'll cut those up. I went to Dollar Tree and I've seen these. <laughs> I'm not really sure how they are going to work or if I'm ever going to use them because I don't like eggs. I eat them in moderation. <laughs> um, that was only a dollar and I got this to put eggs in. I've seen that they had some stencils. I always get batteries. I need some more organization. This is for the ice that I have. And this right here, I got all these to hang wreaths on. Oh, it's a game changer. And at all these, I got an organizer. So um, you can see here it's backwards, but organization. I also got this plant from all these. $4.99. These green pea crisps, they are my favorite lunch. Combos for Brad, and again, noodles. And then I'm going to show you, again, I got, there's more pea crisps, but the birdhouse and the bird feeding station. So that's everything that I got today. Now I'm gonna get our freezer really has to get clean, but I keep pizzas up there. This is all like the fried food, got some breakfast sandwiches, and keep in here hot pockets. So that's from Dollar Tree Organization. All the meat and fish are in this one. And that one I got my ice. Got some Texas toast in there. 
These are vegetables and some other little things. And this is fruits and random meals. So I'm going to be putting everything away because it's melting fast. I just keep the ice packs up there and more frozen stuff and ice packs. I'm running out of time, every day goes by so fast And every moment counts, baby, I don't wanna miss a thing We can sleep under the stars, we can sleep under the stars Or hang out in hotel bars, driving somewhere in your car We can sleep under the stars, we can sleep under the stars Under the stars pounds of hamburger into three different bays and then I took the steak and I divided it up and we will have two different meals of that. So in meat I spent about $25 alone at Pick and Save and then I got bacon at Aldi's plus some chicken thighs from there as well in the frozen department. Thank you so much for watching my video and please subscribe to my channel. Let's connect and follow me on Instagram and Pinterest.